London's newest landmark, the Shard Skyscraper, has opened its doors to the general public. The European Union's tallest building is more than 300 meters tall. One of the first Londoners to step out on the Shard's viewing deck, 244 meters above the British capital, was Mayor Boris Johnson. I think the view is incredible. It's the closest thing I've seen to being in an aeroplane over London, except you're on a stable platform, you can linger, you can study the bends in the river, as you can see my office, you can see everything uh, there is to see in London for 40 miles around. So you can more or less see Paris. It's quite, it's a wonderful place. Designers call the Shard a vertical city with high-end offices, international restaurants, a five-star Shangri-La hotel, exclusive flats, and visitor attractions. The name Shard comes from a sculpted glass design that architects chose to recall London's church spires and the masts of sailing ships docked in the Thames River. Early visitors said they were impressed. I'm astounded. I mean, I expected to be astounded. Others said London's bright lights and 24-hour pace doubled a visitor's viewing experience. It's unprecedented. I've never seen anything like it before. And of course, there are two completely separate views. One is by day, and one is by night. At night, it's this glittering, dazzling array. But by day, you see the whole extent of London. The Shard's designers hope the skyscraper will become a London landmark on par with Westminster Abbey and Big Ben. Over one million visitors are expected in the first year of operation. Over 130,000 tickets to reserve visits to the attraction have already been sold, some four months ahead of time. The most popular date for visiting the Shard so far is Valentine's Day on February the 14th.